So we're gonna make a kart racing game in Unity. I have this map, which I which I will post it down in the description so you can download it as well. It has the the textures and everything, so you just have to download it and just bring it to your to your scene. Now the very first thing we want to do is add collision to the actual track. A very simple step. Just select the track and add the mesh collider. Now I know this is a bit pricey into the performance view, but it's the easiest to learn. So what this is gonna do is make this track actually usable. So we don't just fall through it. Next step is to actually bring your model into the view so if you see closely this places the model wait let me let me get close so if you look closely if we bring the model it will stick it to the actual track because this has collision if you bring it in here it doesn't it just places it randomly that's a nice tip so if we bring it in here if you can see it places it right onto the track this is a cart that I made this has no textures by the way so we can just put some textures really quickly let me just do that okay so I, I have really quickly placed a texture in here so it actually looks like a wheel next thing we want to do is create a uh, controller that controls these wheels so we can actually drive it to do that we can create a uh, script the first thing we want to ask for is the actual wheel colliders because we want to use wheel colliders in here so instead of just doing four wheel colliders we're gonna just do a array of wheel colliders so the way we do that is by saying public wheel wheels the next thing we want to do is add force to these wheel colliders well, that's a very easy step instead of using update we're gonna use a fixed update it's gonna ruin the code I'm gonna make a new one fixed update so the way we control these wheel colliders is by adding torque to them. To add torque to these wheel colliders we need a, some kind of uh, input from the actual keyboard or the or a automatic start system. So for now we're, we're gonna do with the keyboard by pressing a W key. The way we do that is by saying if input dot get key all right so once you make a if statement checking if we press W we're gonna make a for loop to loop through the wheel colliders so the way you do that is by saying for that goes to, to the length in this case wheel colliders length and I++ plus plus, so it actually so it uh, iterates through so the way you, you apply force to the wheels is by saying wheels in the index of i dot motor torque is equal to the torque but we don't have a torque we can add a uh, public load 
torque we're gonna default this to 200 so every time we press W it's gonna make the wheel torque equal to 200 now else we're gonna default it to 0 so we're gonna use the same loop right here and we say 0 if we press play the car moves okay 